Hello everybody, Gamer Penny here bringing you another episode of our Marvel Midnight Suns Let's Play and we are back with our hunter. You could have at least left me a chair. Do your thing. Wait, one second. There we go. Um we are What are we getting ready to do? New quest. I think so. Let me check out heroes. Aha. Edit the deck. I like this cosmic ray. What if we get rid of this one and put in this? No, get rid of this one. This. Yeah. From the deck. Oh. Oh. You look sick. What the heck? Medieval. Marvel. Oh, that's cool. Can you do that for all of them? Oh, you can. Oh, what a cutie. <laughs> okay, hold on. Hold on. You have different stuff? That's really cool. That's basically from her X-Men days, huh? This is really cool. Okay. Well, we're done. Let's go ahead and select a mission. Um, Gamma Coil, Artifact, Tell Cash, Credits, Credits. Requires a general mission to be completed. Okay. Hard. Destroy the device. Beat enemies. Let's do this and get more credits and we bring in... Okay, me and magic. Magic, me. And blade. No, and... You know, we haven't really done Iron Man or Doctor Strange. What about magic? Me. And we'll try her. We'll try this group. Can you? Beat all enemies to complete the encounter. Hydra's goons are getting a little too comfortable for my liking. I think it's time you took them down a notch. We hear you. You've gained the shove ability. Enter move mode and highlight the enemy that you'd like to knock back with a powerful shove. With her unpredictable staff of one, many of Nico's abilities may have random effects. These effects are determined when the ability card is drawn and are indicated by the roulette keyword. Okay. Show them what happens when you mess with the Midnight Suns. This feels all too familiar. Um. Do a quick. 
on this guy. Level up, Just perfect. Like old times. Um, I'm going to redraw this. We'll do this. There was a time when Lilith had the highest of standards for her minions. That time has then we'll do passed. this. Consider it done. What is it like being so inconsequential? Perfect. That wasn't bad. Okay, let's end the turn. Cover the contents of a red storage. For the mother. They are still coming for me. No retreat. It's okay. My head is totally messed up. We are not done yet. You've got nothing to fear. And there are a lot of people. Okay, let's use this. Blueprint. Phase removed. Okay, knock back and quick, huh? Can I get all of them? I can. Um, let's redraw this. This is a quick. Hail that. Draw this. Okay. What is happening? Someone call for reinforcements? Yeah, I'm liking this plan. Okay, let's do this. I bet your Hydra recruiter didn't mention any of this, huh? By two weak? Watch closely. Being a fascist wasn't good enough, huh? You had to get into demon worship too?
No one wants to hit the hunter who has the counter on. Chip away at me like some tree. Lilith must be desperate if we draw these this. Are best. Strengthen you. Let me help. I will return the favor when I can. up this do that and let's do target um all right let's do this I'm afraid you might not make it back from this one. And then how are we all on health? We're pretty good on health. So I'm going to redraw this one. Weak, even for Hydra. Okay. To some um, damage to this Lady guy. Me to mention your mother. Apparently, she is promiscuous. Here Did she say go. Blade told me to mention your mother? <laughs> there we go. Hopefully, they learned their lesson. But we all know that's wishful thinking. Story. Magic. That's not magic, though. Continue. Girl squad. Hello, Nico. Hunter, I need your help. Magic's birthday is coming up. I want to throw her a surprise party, but I can't do it alone. Of course I'll help. What do you need me to do? If you could get the other Midnight Suns on board, it would take a huge weight off my shoulders. Should I mention this to Tony, Carol, and the others? Uh, I don't know if they can keep a secret. I'm not even sure if I'll tell them about the party until that night. Oh, but I should probably invite Spider-Man. He seems like he'd really get into it. Do you really need me to do this? I don't, but I want them to see more of what I see. That you're part of the team. It'll mean a lot coming from you. All right, let me know what you want. Still figuring out who and what I need, but I'll message you when I do. Probably tomorrow? Sounds good. Thanks for this. Do you have any questions? Where are we going to have the party? I'm still scouting locations, but somewhere inside the Abbey. We'll make it work. No more questions. That is all I had. I am good for now. I'm good if you're good. Thanks for this, Hunter. Can't wait to see the look on her face. I don't feel like she's gonna like it. Objectives, talk to Spider-Man. And so you actually slept in that thing. That was probably a mistake. I kept having dreams that I was swallowed by Sandman. That's, uh, actually happened, you know. Look, man, I get it. It's not a decision to take lightly. I struggled with it for a while myself. What changed your mind? 
I guess I finally started trusting these fools. They may be a little crazy, but they're like family. And what about your real family? Don't you worry about what could happen? Ah, they're back in LA. Much as my kid brother Gabe would love this place, they don't know a thing. Whatever happens here, never gets back there. To be honest, I don't even think we're in the same dimension. Um, what? Uh, never mind that. Point is, this is a safe place with good people. If there's anyone who can keep a secret, it's them. Sort of comes with the territory of being a midnight sun. Most of our lives weren't sunshine and candy before Caretaker recruited us. And now we've got a gigantic, demonically powered pizza oven in the forge. Excuse me, would you... Hey, man. It's okay. We can talk about something else if you want. Yes, please stay. Can't. Got something I need to do. Okay. I really thought I had him with the pizza thing. What is it with you both and pizza? Okay, you wanted it, you got it. Wanted what? I give you by popular demand, the man underneath the mask. Peter Parker from Forest Hills, Queens. Nice to see you finally ditch the spider face doily, Peter. We're all friends here. You got our attention, so what do you got to say, Petey? Um, hi? <laughs> Hello, Peter. After all that build-up, I hope I didn't disappoint anybody. I mean, I can't shoot laser beams, light my skull on fire, or glow like the sun. Like Tony said, outside of the costume, I'm just boring old Peter Parker. I don't even have a cool screen name. I have seen you in battle with Venom, Peter. Believe me when I say you are anything but boring. Aw, thanks. Jeez, Hunter, are you trying to make me blush? I did not realize you embarrassed so easily. <laughs> Aww. Oh yeah, I actually surprise myself at the things that embarrass me. Speaking of, now that we took care of the giant radioactive spider elephant in the room, we might as well get to know one another. If there's anything else you're curious to know about me, ask away. I'm apparently an open book now. So what do you say, Hunter? Care to step inside this spider verse? Ooh. Um, how do you become a Spider Man? I have encountered werewolves, half vampires, dragon men, but I have never encountered a Spider Man before. There must be quite a story about how you became this way. It's actually not the most epic story. Sort of a field trip gone wrong scenario, if you get me. <laughs> I do not. Well, a small irradiated spider bit me while I was working up the nerve to ask Mary Jane Watson if she'd like to check out the Pym Particle exhibit at the Empire State Museum. Next thing I know, the high-energy photons injected into my bloodstream started altering my genomic sequence. At first, I thought I was having an allergic reaction, and then I started climbing up the walls. I told my Aunt May it was late-onset puberty. She, uh, believed me for some reason. <laughs> so, how about you? Get bit by a radioactive hunter or something? I was born a hunter. My mother is the harbinger of a dark god. A normal life was never in the cards for me. Yeesh. I thought high school was hard to deal with. That's gotta be a heavy load to carry. It is not always easy. The story with you and Venom. This Venom creature's obsession with you is strong enough to overcome my mother's call. Until now, I thought that impossible. It's, a uh, complicated. Eddie, the guy underneath the giant oozing mouth, was a reporter with me at the Bugle a while back. I may have ruined his career by exposing a phony source of his on this big murder case. Mm. This, of course, led him to the alien symbiote that had secretly bonded with me after my original suit was trashed on Battleworld. We can talk about that little adventure later. Long story short, I thought I had eradicated the suit with a giant church bell. Before I knew it was alive, of course. Anywho, the alien symbiote decided to merge with Eddie, and the two have been hunting me down ever since. It's your basic simple misunderstanding, right? Well... I guess every superhero needs a super nemesis. Venom is mine. 
It must be tough having your own mom be yours, huh? My duty to stop her. Lilith made her choice long ago. Though it pains me to say this, she is no longer my mother, but another monster to slay. That's a hard way to look at it. When I see Venom, all I can see is Eddie. And the symbiote that saved my life on a few occasions. Perhaps that is what Lilith is counting on. Look, I get it. The monster that looks like your friend is still a monster. I watch plenty of zombie movies, okay? Still doesn't mean you have to become that which you were hunting, if you ask me. I knew that philosophy minor was gonna pay off! Okay, I should be on my way. Thank you, Peter. I should be going. This was... eye-opening. For both of us? I gotta thank you too, Hunter. I was sort of holding back before. You know, didn't want to be a chatty Charlie. But now the floodgates are open. Let the real Peter Parker flow through! Anyway, um, you gotta go. I'll talk to you soon. Of that I have no doubt. Farewell, Peter. Good chatting with you, Hunter. Yeah, good talking to you. So, anything else you're curious about? Be on my way. Thank you, Peter. I should be... For... Got... Of that... Good chatting with you, Hunter. Okay. Now we can hang out with someone. Um... Tony or Robbie. Let's join a hangout with Robbie. Let's do some... Working out? No, playing cards? Be playing cards. I need to take you street racing. Is that like running? No, in a car. You race through empty streets, pushing your ride as hard as it can take it, and leave the other racers in your dust. There's nothing like it. Can't wait. As soon as this is over, we shall street race. <laughs> All right. First thing, we hit a junkyard for parts. We are going to put together a real monster on the road. You do not want to use the hell ride? Nah, it's no fun if you win every time. You want this goblet? <laughs> I could do that again. He liked the activity. We got a conversation. So five, six, seven, eight. Continue. So he only liked playing cards. All right, let's go to the forge. Wonder if he would have liked working out more. I can't do anything here? I guess not. I guess at night you can't. Um. M. Agatha has got something for us. So, heroic essence. Vitamin. And Agatha is, of course, this way. Hunter, hello. Can't talk to her. Yes, dear? Magic surprise party. You are welcome to attend Ileana's surprise party. <laughs> as much as I would enjoy that, my presence unsettles those incapable of perceiving me. I'll celebrate from afar. So you will be there in spirit. Oh, Hunter, how <laughs> I've missed your wit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright, let's go to bed. <laughs> Um, yeah, let's go to bed. Okay, next day.
Time to start doing some stuff. Before a club meeting can be scheduled, the club runner will first message to ask if you're ready. Respond to their message and the club will happen on the next night the club members are free. Emo kids meeting invitation. First person to ask is Robbie. He's thoughtful, he'll find the right gift to give magic on behalf of the team. Ten oyster mushrooms, wolfsbane, skill essence. Essence, Wolfsbane, Oyster Mushroom. Okay. Don't tell me to calm down, Robbie. The others are in there with freaking caretaker planning their next move against Faustus, and they are totally leaving us out. Again! But this is the Avengers we're talking about, right? They're heroes. And who had to bail out those heroes when your new pal Spider-Man was being chased by the alien slime monster? Us! Got you there. If they are so powerful, why could Strange not help us save Wanda? Look, Doc's a good guy, okay? He's patched up a spider in a year two since I started this thing. Flaming pumpkin bombs are not exactly covered by insurance. I would not trust him to patch a tire. They move into our home, take it over, and then have the nerve to leave us out of every single damn decision that affects us. Dang. You two want to cozy up to Mr. Stark and Doctor Strange? Go right ahead. Me, I'll be outside. Most of the air's been sucked up from here already. Uh-oh. Hunter, got a question for you. Sure, what do you got? Nico made some good points, but I gotta be honest. I'm getting used to the Avengers being around this place. I mean, yeah, Tony can be annoying, but not all of them. Of course. Although it makes me wonder. Wonder what? Well, what are they thinking about us? When facing a demon, aim for the heart. Always do. Then why are you talking to me when you should really be talking to them? Or at least, her. Ooh. I have no idea what you're talking about. You have many abilities, Daywalker. <laughs> Lying is not one of them. He likes Carol. Admit what you feel about Carol. You owe yourself that much. Admit what? That I feel a sense of admiration and respect for a fellow teammate? I'm sure she admires you, too. I have no doubt Carol also appreciates what you bring to the team. I hope so. I try to do my best for my allies. Well, I am sure she is also impressed with your efforts and has noticed you as much as you have clearly noticed her. I'm not going there, Hunter. Let's just drop it. Consider it dropped. Oh, and this conversation? It never happened. <laughs> I will add it to the list. <laughs> we should challenge Nico and Eliana to a game of hearts. Hunter, I have a feeling we're gonna go on lots of adventures together. What are you guys doing? Hunter, just the person I wanted to see. Okay, I'll be honest with you, anyone is the person I want to see right now. At this point, I'd sit down for a tea with Galactus if it meant I didn't have to sift through these gamma readings for another second. It's all just starting to blur into one big giant green gamma mess, you know? And my favorite big giant green gamma mess is too busy to help. You'll get through this. I have seen you harness the power of a sun. I believe you will find a way, Dr. Banner or not. More of a white hole versus star, but I hear ya. Still, just because a gal can absorb gamma energy doesn't mean she's ready to teach a class on it at Empire State. And it's not just that. I've got a bad feeling about things lately, okay? Particularly when it comes to you and Bruce. I'm what they call a precog. I catch glimpses of the future. 
No idea why, but I'm sure really? channeling the power of a mini white hole through your entire body might have a little something to do with it. What exactly did you see? Nothing specific. More of an impression. You and Bruce. Your faces. You didn't look good. <sighs> Is this what Steven goes through? I sometimes catch glimpses, too. The past, the future, sometimes a different present. Though the source of our visions may differ, you are not alone in this burden. <laughs> Forgot I was talking to the Chosen One there for a second. Still, I actually find that somehow comforting. Maybe we can start a tortured vision book club or something. I am always here if you want to talk about them. I might just take you up on that. My visions are chaotic at best, and very few and far between. Maybe a while before I can make sense of this one. <sighs> I should get back on task. I think I've ignored these numbers long enough. Talk to you later. Hey, Steven, hello. Please, watch yourself. Hey. Hope hey, hero. Um, darkness is merely absence of light, Doctor. We will bring our light to Wanda and we will save her. Thanks, Hunter. Hunter? Hey, hello, caretaker. I couldn't help but hear some raised voices in the other room. Was wondering if you knew what all the fuss was about. Was there some argument? You might want to talk to Nico directly. Why? Is she upset? I do not want to speak for her. But she seemed angry about Wanda. I want to grieve too, but none of us have that luxury right now, or else we'll be grieving the whole world. Thank you for your honesty. I will have to think about how to handle this with Nico. We'll speak later. I didn't get the impression she was upset with Wa about Wanda. Um, objectives. Private superlink message. I will talk to Robbie. Invite Robbie to the birthday party. Where is he? Outside. And of course, you came to find me. Well, I actually Robbie, came to talk to Robbie. Can you speak in private? Of course. Let's go. Nico needs help prepping for Magic's surprise party. All right. What does she need me to do? She wanted you to pick the team present for Magic. Oh, I got this. I'll find something unforgettable. Perfect. And then let's go examine that gamma coil. Uh, give me a sec. Okay, what's up? Got some upgrades for you, hot off the press. Change the cost Forge. of a random heroic card in your hand to zero. Um, I'd like that. And I like this one. Okay. Research. What I don't think we can do remember? anything with... Later. Okay. New ability to upgrade. Ready for more? Upgrade that. <laughs> Nothing's gonna stop me now. Got something to upgrade? I think we've got something for everyone. Not enough resources.
Daily sparring. Who should we spar with? Ooh, we get an arcane key. Um, let's... Who are we gonna take on our next mission? Let's take... Um, let's take Nico on the next no, mission. I know magic, right? You. Training, level two. Explosives training. If you can beat Carol in a straight fight, I'll let you skip training. Good luck with that. Hey, you okay? Now I can't talk to you, huh? All right, well, let's go to the map. New story mission featuring Deadpool is now available. <coughs> Deadpool's missions can be undertaken at any time without regard to the main story. Complete the first Deadpool mission to add him to the Midnight Suns roster. Really? Alright, let's go do that then. Is this the story mission? The bill comes due. Bell cat. Artifact. Get Deadpool. New York? Is there a problem? Another one? Central's picking up some unusual activity at the New York Museum of Art. <laughs> Look like at him. In. It's all stolen artwork, recently recovered from the personal collection of... Deadpool? That... The Harlequin is an art thief? Harlequin? <laughs> uh, no. Red Skull is the art thief. Deadpool is more of a... Kind of like... You really need to see for yourself. <laughs> oh no, he did a cartwheel. Deadpool and me only, huh? All right, let's go do it. Talk to Deadpool. Good luck, kiddo. You're going to need it. Caretaker? Are you sitting in with Carol? Oh, no. Not if Deadpool's involved. He cannot be that bad. <laughs> <laughs> Just wait. Mystic in the warehouse. No candles. Whatever Hydra is looking for, it seems they have yet to find it. Just don't let them find you. <laughs> you the new guy? Huh? Sorry, the new fully customizable heroically upgradable monster masher. Wisecracking anti-hero. Merc, very occasional hero. Whatever. I'm adaptable. Spin me off. It's a big franchise. <laughs> Stop talking. Are you here for the statue too? What statue? The one my very mysterious and very scary client from somewhere in very Eastern Europe wants me to steal back from the guy who stole it from him? It's the circle of crime. That one? Well, Jimmy, my frickin' chagas. Yeah. That one. Hands up and pants down, ladies and gents. This is a robbery. I'm sorry. Have we met? Aren't you... Sloth? No, no. Sylvia. Cindy? Please kill him. Sin! That's it. Of course, Sin! Granddaughter of Redhead. I mean Skull. I mean Skull. Whatever. No! It's just us two, huh? Defeat all enemies. 
I wonder how hard this one is. Stealth approaches. What is this? I have yet to participate in one that was actually quiet. In quiet Fuego times zero. Almost never quiet, and things go kind of quick. Not terrible for me sometimes. Try not to get wiped out by Hydra flunkies while you're mouthing off. Not dying is actually okay. I am impressed. We've got a quick. We'll take care of this guy. Hell. Twenty-six. Do this. Leave some for the rest of. And then this. Are we excited? <laughs> Sorry, babe. It's not you, it's me. And we can do this. Bad luck for you, friendo. Smell the rainbow. Um, and then we can end the turn. Get very, very Clones? I don't think they were done cooking yet. I'd love to hear who hired you to steal that artifact if you're feeling chatty, and I know you are. Wait, you my ear. Who is this? Uh Carol Danvers? Why is that name so familiar? I'm Captain Marvel. It's finally happening! Always happy to meet my fans. It's about time! <laughs> Here are those two. <laughs> Why is that I so love that fun? he's, um, obsessing over Carol. Calling him. Okay, <laughs> get rid of some of that block. Now that was something. Do some damage here. Allow me. Okay. I saw a move like that once, centuries ago. Alright, end the turn. Ouch! Whoa, Anyone else taste those leprechauns? Looks and like more reinforcements. Okay. They do not seem to be a match for us. Weak, even for Hydra. Um, uh, redraw. Redraw this one. We'll do a heal on you. The light will heal you. Do this. You are lucky to still be breathing. And a quick on you. Truly your best? Is he not dazed yet? Like... Let's draw... Can't redraw, so... We'll go ahead and end. There we go. KO'd his own person. How'd you even manage to find this place? Okay. Tracking Hydra long? You're really pumping me for information here. I'm slightly around. <laughs> One time I sit in for caretaker, this is what I get. A lunatic pervert mercenary. Lunatic pervert mercenary? That's my favorite anime. 
Oh god, I love Deadpool. And he leveled I get up. To wear big boy pants now? 37. Um, let's do big damage on this guy. They cannot possibly match your strength. Got two cards. Can you feel the love? Redraw this one. Okay, I mean that's pretty good for next. Is in control of the situation. Next turn. Please don't be dazed. Okay. I don't know. And we've got a quick. Did you say Eastern Europe? Is that where your client is? No, 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 not what I said. You didn't hear that. New Jersey. I'm taking it to Jersey. Jewel of the waste management industry. You are a terrible Excellent. Liar. Oh yeah? Well, at least I can use contractions. <laughs> oh gosh. Our play refunded. One in fuego. Uh oh. <laughs> Step away from the artifact. Click. Did you just say click? Yes, I did. For emphasis. Now hand over the statue. Fool. Do you know what? <laughs> Monologue free zone here. It's in my contract. Sorry. Now respect the click and hand over the. Whoa. Big click energy. I like it. Want to help me kill some Nazis? Hydra aren't Nazis. Ah, potato frittata. <laughs> what they have outlives their usefulness to me. I oh, he took a picture of the bat. See? I had your back. Right. Where is Sin and the statue? Oh. <laughs> hmm. The level designer says she went that way. Why betray her own people? Maybe she appreciates a plot twist? <laughs> you first. Let this be a mole man thing. Cause you know uh -oh. I'm the biggest mole man fan. Uh oh. Defeat all vampires to complete the encounter. Vampire attacks can infect hero cards, conferring bleeding on the hero when the card is played. Vampire minions can grow stronger when a hero suffers bleeding damage. It would seem Yikes. Hydra and their mistress have escaped with the artifact. Is this like one of those monkey's paw things? I say, Mole Man, and the universe gives us off-brand vampires? They're vampires. It's a whole... Don't ask. Wasn't gonna. So, is there some special way to dust these critters? Feed them before they eat you? Bet you can't guess how many times I've heard that. Too weak for this fight. Do this one. Insert catchphrase here. <laughs> I am impressed. 
take out another one. Are there more coming? Leave some for the rest of us. Okay, let's end the turn. So he's gonna bleed. And that's not cool. There are more coming. Where's Blade when you need him? Technically, aren't these things his cousins? No relation. Word of advice. Never suggest Blade is like other vampires. Oh, we've met. He did not appreciate my humor. Um Mine. Um let's do this. Your mother abandoned Bleed. you. Rapid growth. Uh-oh. Let's do this. Feel my call. Let's do a heal that will draw two cards. This shall be of great help. Okay. Just saying we could use the help of an actor right here. I'll bet. Shouldn't be any blood suckers left in that part of the city. They appear to be some sort of man bats of both the white and blue. Dorsal striping indicates. They are new breed vampires, both immature and fully developed. I don't like that at all. Thanks for calling, Blade. Super helpful. <laughs> Somebody call the meat wagon! Okay, let's do that. Get rid of as many as we can at once. Once again, Lilith's servants fall. Do this. Okay, we've got two more, basically. Uh, let's do a heal on you. The light will carry you onward. Oh, I can really feel okay. the love. Okay, we'll end the card, or end the turn. Break my resolve. Where are they hiding the clown car? I knew I should have asked for more money, or maybe some actual money instead of all that um, stop cryptocurrency. We can worry about sin Frick. and the statue later. Focus on getting out of there. Oh, so it's me now. I knew you'd come around. I have that effect. On you. you do have that effect on people. Knock back. Return to your mother. And death from above over here. 
That should be everyone, I think. I should probably feel these vampires are a problem. At least we know how to handle them. Dang. Without that statue, not even a sparkly hole can cheer me up. <laughs> Is this about your very scary client again? When he finds out how royally I botched this mission, or worse, when he finds me, I'll be... <laughs> Deader pool? There it is! You go, <laughs> new guy! And by that, I still obviously mean the new fully customizable... Come back with us to the Abbey. No. The magical wards will protect you. No. Hell no. You can hide there. Help us track down Sin. No! No! no. <laughs> the vampire infestation. If you insist. Look, Ma, I'm gonna be DLC! <laughs> no. <laughs> no! <laughs> Oh god, that was good. <laughs> Deadpool! We've got Deadpool! <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Why does Caretaker hate Deadpool? <laughs> Alright. <laughs> All right, well, we are going to go ahead and end the episode here. Um, when we come back, we'll continue on. We'll talk to Deadpool, um, and we'll see what's what all is going on. So, guys, I want to thank you so much. Hunter's Choices have allowed the light within to grow brighter. A new collar is now available for the hunter to equip, granting a powerful passive ability in combat. Continue earning light balance points to unlock further. You can equip it at any time outside of combat. Collars grant powerful passive rewards when the hunter plays certain card types in combat. Yeah, ivory collar. Okay. All right, with that, we're going to go ahead and end the episode here. Guys, I want to thank you so much for all of your support on this series. If you do want to see more of the Midnight Suns Let's Play, make sure to leave a like or subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, I will see you guys next time. All right, bye-bye, everyone.